says I'm special. But I'm just saying what everybody else wants me to say. I feel like I'm suffocating and no one can see me. No, wait! Yeah, I see you. What's your name? Because I... Yeah. yeah. My parents thought it sounded African. <laughs> When did you ever tell me that you didn't want this? When I was on that balcony. You saw the goodness in me. I can finally see it in myself. Beyond the Lights, rated PG-13, in theaters November 14th. It's very contemporary. It's about our world now. Um, it's a love story, obviously, um, set in the music industry, but also, I think, revealing um, the human side beneath the sort of, you know, pop princess diva and, and hopefully offering, um, you know, a new female perspective, you know, female writer, female director. Um, so it's very empowering for women and, and uplifting. Yeah, you got it. Zach, move to the chair for a second. I'm gonna get you on the floor, all right? Nice. Are you getting full? Are you getting full body as well? I am getting full body as well. That's Foxy. That's it right there. Can you arch your back just a little bit? Yeah, exactly. Don't you add that over here? For, for the character, a very powerful moment of her sort of reclaiming herself. And I think that, you know, again, you know, I think our sub subconsciously we sometimes make beauty choices that we don't even realize are sort of damaging and um, and so for me you know I think it's a really powerful scene for the character and you know myself you know I've never worn a purple weave in in reality so um, but I understood the symbolic significance of it uh, so um, so yeah and it was really fun it was fun to kind of like take that knife and like <laughs> you know start start sort of like you know hacking away at the hair that had I'd been in, uh, you know, hair and makeup for an hour to put it in. So um, it was fun, but also, you know, important, I think. It just shows the clip. It okay. can get you to the spot. Love the hair. You guys are supposed to return back to your seats after your performance. This way, this way. Oh, Nate is such a lovely guy and such a professional. Um, you know, he's he's very grounded and um, you know, somewhat like his character. You know, has a strong sense of integrity and and is very principled. And um, it was really fun working with him. He he'd worked with Gina um, previously, and in fact, we uh, Gina set us up on this sort of improvised date in our characters and and sent us off to lunch. You know, in costume, and we sort of had to kind of act in character the whole time. And and then she hijacked us with some paparazzi and you know the whole thing you know Nate was on board with that whole um, improvisation and then developing the relationship so it was it was really great working with him